Okay, if you want to know how to start a fire, right. most people will tell you use cotton balls. Yes, that works too, but if you don't have cotton balls, you can use paper towel, toilet paper, either one, and Vaseline or petroleum jelly, as some people call it. Uh, now, this is what I do. I just take a paper towel, tear it in half, and I just waller it around down in there. Yes, I just said the word waller. Okay. That's it. That's all I do. And then I pull it back out. I put it in the grill. And I light it. Now, you can use one of these. Or matches. Or just a regular old lighter. Any of that will do. Now, as you can see, that is burning. And it will burn long enough. For you to be able to put something on top of it to keep your fire going. It can be wood. It can be old dried leaves. It can be paper. It's a great way to get rid of your junk mail, by the way. And then you've got a, a good fire going. Alright, now, if you take a piece of toilet paper, you can do the same exact thing. And since that's already burning, I'm going to show you. Just do it very carefully. Okay, that is how you start a fire with Vaseline and paper towels or toilet paper. That's all you got to do. Okay, but you also, because I'm not using gloves, I never do, might want to keep a pack of baby wipes on hand so that after you start the fire, you can get the Vaseline off, off of your hands. Okay. So there you go. That's how you start a fire using Vaseline, petroleum jelly, and paper towel or toilet paper. Any of those will do. Yes, you can also use cotton balls. That's what most people use. But if you don't have any, most people have toilet paper on hand. That works great. All right, there you go.